So on page 54 in chapter 2 is question number 13 and says the following is a cross tabulation of whether respondents rent or own their home by social, social class for a sample of 240 heads of household. So when you look at the chart, I don't know if you can see the chart, you look at the chart it puts on the side here the, uh, the class so they could be low class, middle class, or upper class and then whether or not they rent or own. So which of these is the independent variable and which is the dependent variable? So independent, what does someone have no control over really is what social class they're in, right? So independently I, I round up a group of people and they're going to be either uh, lower class, middle class, or upper class. Now depending on that, they'd be more likely to rent or own depending on their social class, right? So the housing status is the dependent variable because it really depends on your, your income levels whether or not you could rent or own. So again, social class you have very little control over, so that's what's going to be independent. That's what you start with. You start with your social class and then dependent upon that is whether or not you can rent or own.